Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new to our channel, go on ahead and hit the red subscription button, turn the bell all the way gray. This is our family channel, but we do have a reaction channel. Check out the link down below and give us a follow over there. Guys, today I'm going to be giving my feelings on Stranger Things, the series, all right? 2016 I have been following this theory now tell me I know I cannot be the only adult that is in total love with this sci-fi drama series it is brilliant I absolutely love it let me know down below y'all I really really love it I can't believe I'm gonna have to wait until July to see the second part of season four but I have I me I have a sneaky feeling about how this whole series is about to end and I want your opinion on it. So I'm going to jump right on into talking first of all about who my favorite characters are. You know what? But before I do that, I introduce my son to this series. He is so scared to come on camera. Anyway, y'all. I'm really, I'm getting my son's opinion on this series. I got him hooked on it. And initially when I told him he had to watch this drama series, this sci-fi, he was like, no, it's not something I want to watch. No, mom. I was like, no, for real. Just give it a try. Watch the first, second, third episode, and I guarantee you, you're going to like it. Before I knew it, he was all caught up. Like, how long did it take you to watch and get caught up? About a week. <laughs> a week, y'all. About a week. I don't want to do any spoilers because I'm all caught up and I can't believe I have to wait until July to see the second half and I have a theory. I have a theory about how this whole thing is going to end, but I want to find out from Michael. Michael, mm -hmm. what made you like the series? It was just good. I don't, I don't know. I, I think it was because of um, like monster stuff. I don't know. Monsters, <laughs> aliens. Weird, weird stuff. So, um, like, and they're good actors too. Like, like for kid actors, right? Like, yeah. they did a, they do a real good job, right? Like, who is your fave? Who's your fave? Dustin. He is my fave too. I absolutely love Dustin. I love his mom too. She cracks me up. She cracks me up. And I love, I love that Steve has been paired up with Dustin. They have a good bromance. They have a bromance going on. Like a love hate kind of thing. I absolutely love it. And it kind of started like right at the end. Was that the end of season one with the prom, the dance? When he was kind of like teaching him how to make his hair look good, how to get a girl, oh, yeah. blah, blah, blah. That's kind of like where it started. But I think pairing them up has add like a whole kind of comedic flair to the whole series and that's really needed like who's your second favorite character you don't like 11 i would say l but l is uh fantabulous based, but based off of the first and second episode that i've seen in the fourth season she's getting bullied she is and i don't like her that is sad all. i don't like her getting yeah. bullied either um, and she has no powers anymore, so she's not cool. <laughs> she is cool, but she's sad and being bullied. I don't like that. I don't like that, but I totally understand it. And who do you who do you not like so far in the series? Like, who's your like least favorite character? Lucas. I just don't think he has a purpose. He, he Lucas. Hasn't, he hasn't really done anything really, besides that one time where he shot that slingshot in the mall and like the group wouldn't be the away. same without lucas yeah. lucas brings them back to earth anyway my least favorite character i don't have a least favorite character right now i like all of them but initially it was steve I couldn't, because he was a bully but his character and he was messing with jonathan his character got built Right, I know. He got better, but really, I wanted him gone at first. I was like, he got to go. I don't like him, and I didn't like any of his friends. That group. Billy was worse. No, but I totally understand Billy's well, story, though. Story, yeah, Billy was bullied himself, and that's what made Billy, Billy. But outside of that, I liked Billy. 
Because I understood him. Like Steve had no reason to be who he was other than he was a rich kid. Yeah, I don't like that. But he, but he changes that. though. So he has I changed, mean. and now I love him. But let me tell you guys what I will not have you do to us. Do not, please, don't pair Nancy and Steve back up. It's not fair. They're supposed to. Be, she's supposed to be with Jonathan. I absolutely love her with Jonathan. Even though you know it's a little weird thing going on, but don't put her back with Steve. And I think that's what you guys are trying to do. That's the vibe that I kind of caught, don't do it. I'm warning you, don't do it. It won't be good for me or either of them. Anyway, this, do you want to hear my theory? I don't think it's going to be a spoiler. This is my theory, y'all. And let me know if you feel the same. Let me know if you feel the same. I feel, how, how do you think this series is going to end? That, let me get that from you and then I'm going to give you not, my feelings on the whole thing. I'm not far enough in season to determine I, I don't know what do you think I don't even know okay. how this Vecna thing works oh so I don't want to give him any spoilers so I'm gonna have to have him exit thank you very much for your participation and now I'm gonna tell you guys what my theory is this is my theory y'all Michael is only in what two episodes in in season four so he know about Vecna but he don't know who Vecna is. So I'm not gonna spoil that for him, right? But I think everybody is thinking that in the end there's gonna be this master throw down fight between Eleven and Vecna. Because guess what? The Mind Flayer, she's the one that got rid of him earlier on in the series, right? So I think obvious, obvious, people are thinking there's gonna be a throw down battle in end of season four because i don't think there's gonna be a season five there's nowhere to be a season five it has to end season four has to it has to end it has to like how much further can it go like for real has vecna l don't have any powers it's obvious we gotta get her powers back we need to get rid of vecna who's gonna come after vecna for it to go on if it goes on i'll watch it, but i think it's gonna end i think it's gonna end i think season four is the last season but I don't think that's what's gonna happen. The throwdown battle is not going to be between Elle and Vicna. You know who I think it's gonna be between? Like you don't believe it's gonna stop at season four. You think there's gonna be another series? Another season? I think it's gonna end at season four. He doesn't, I think so. Let me know what you think down below. But if, if, hypothetically, right? Thinking or talking. If season four is the last season, I have a brilliant theory. Check me out in the next video to find out what my theory is. Give us a big thumbs up, y'all. Let me know your comments down below. Let me know if I am the only adult out here that's loving this series. I don't think I'm the only one. I need your support, y'all. Subscribe, hit that red subscription button, and check me out to see what my theory is, y'all.